afternoon to everyone over at Facebook and Viber. What's up to me? Walla Walla to Luz, Samantila, Joanne Esguera, Nomer Pena Jr., Lester Mike Chua, Leia Ruth, good afternoon. Hi to Juan Miguel and of course to Michael Paras and his wife, Anna Katrina, to the Ateneo Human Rights Center and to everyone over at the International Development Law Organization, Nai, Karen, Jen and Joyce, to Attorney and Mao Manigbas and also to the Hank Yu Hanshin Business Development Department, Ms. Jill Navarro, Ms. Joanna, Fred Mix and Miss Eri Fujimori. Happy Friday, you guys. You just heard SZA, Billboard Woman of the Year with Travis Scott with Love Galore. And we've got an update for you about Travis Scott because if you haven't heard yet, he and his lawyer are expected to meet with officials at the New York Police Department with a rapper being accused of assault at a New York City club. That just happened yesterday. And um, it was previously reported that police are investigating allegations that he assaulted a sound engineer and caused $12,000 worth of damage to sound equipment at a nightclub called Nebula. No charges have been filed in the incident and Scott has not been named as a suspect. In case you're a big fan, no need to worry too much. And according to his representative, all the um, statements or any statement about the incident involving Travis are clearly an attempt to sensationalize what is nothing more than a misunderstanding. You know, I'm not a big fan, but I do hope it is a misunderstanding and um, we'll keep you posted for any development regarding this matter, okay? If you want to read more about it, you can check it out right now on facebook.com slash jbonline. That is my name in case you just tuned in. I'll be here up until 8 p.m. For the next hour, we've got Kate Corner plus more updates, but right now, let's play you more music here. Something from Mandy Moore and Can We Still Be Friends? Can we still be friends? <laughs> Keep it right here on 103.5 K-Lite. We can. 